and you also have to believe that Almighty God's last messenger, final avatar, kal ki avatar is Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Anything that doesn't fit into your logic, you will reject. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your girl Fanelungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, do not forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Fanelungu, and on this channel, we post reaction videos each and every day. Although these past few days I haven't been uploading because by the last three, my last three weeks have just been so hectic, so much going on, so much to do and hopefully now that I have time or I have rested well, I feel like I can post each and every day now at least without, maybe I can post once or twice but whichever one waits out otherwise I'm just glad to be free glad to be reacting and just just glad to be here a big shout out to the person that suggested this video and a big shout out to everyone else that's been suggesting subscribing giving us things to do you guys are the best and we thank you very much and i mean we're almost reaching fifteen thousand or like 800 so 800 subscribers away from reaching 15,000 so you guys do your thing so yeah, as I was saying um thank you for being here I hope you guys are doing all right uh, like I said on this channel we post reaction videos each and every day we've got a second YouTube channel called funny and Jesse 2.0 and you can just head there and check out our um videos that we post every weekend and now we're also i'm not sure if we're going to be doing it all the time but we're going to be dropping visuals of our podcast as well other than that like i said we've got a podcast you can find us on itunes um this channel this reaction channel and we're now on spotify diving in with funny and jesse and we've got some interesting um conversations that are up there you can hit there listen to some and just let us know what you think other than that you can find us on patreon you can become a member feel free to become a member you can find us on social media funny and jesse on instagram funny and jesse on facebook as well and we'll react like i like i said thank you to the person that suggested this and thank you to everyone that's been suggesting watching our stuff you guys are the best so today i'm actually going to be reacting to Sadhguru destroys sakina x married branding odd aids sexual compulsions oh the title is a little bit strong but i mean it's always good to get someone else's point of view so i don't know what to expect from this video and i'm just excited to see the content of this so without wasting time let's get into the video if a woman of 13 years old finds the virtuous man of 112 years i would prefer this is hormone fired freedom okay <laughs> medical science tells us even a man of 112 years can procreate can give birth to a child, true? Your intelligence has been hijacked by hormones. <laughs> so, you question the fundamentals of everything. I would not mind giving my daughter if I know that he's a virtuous man and will see to it that he takes my daughter to Jannah, I would not mind. But what is your qualification for you to go to heaven? Well, you have to die first. <laughs> if you want to go to heaven, first thing is you must die, isn't it? So, you left your body here and you went to heaven without your body. Now, what do you do with good food and virgins? <laughs> you have no body. How will you eat the good food and what are you going to do with the virgins? <laughs> In Islam, you can marry a woman the moment she gets mature. Such people, you will see after some time what will happen to them. Life has its ways to bend you and break you and knead you and grind you. 
in a million different ways. In most unexpected ways, it will do it to you. So if you are a strict Brahmin, you have no option but to believe there's one God, he has got no images, he has got no ideas. You have become a slave of logic and completely missing the magic of life. And you also have to believe that Almighty God's last messenger, final avatar, Kalki avatar is Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Anything that doesn't fit into your logic, you will reject. In this, you rejected the entire cosmos. Surah Nisa chapter 4, verse number 34. When you beat your wife, you should not beat on the face. When you beat your wife, there should be no mark left on her body. Please tell me all the ladies. <laughs> In Islam, wife bashing is prohibited. It is daraba means beat her lightly. That means, first you tell her she's wrong. You admonish her. Don't share the bed with her. Ultimatum, last warning. Beat her lightly. Bang. Wife bashing is prohibited. Beat her lightly. Prohibited. Beat her lightly. Bang. The culture tells you fixing your husband is not a good thing. <laughs> you must fix yourself. <laughs> Do you believe that God has got no image? Yeah. Yes, you believe that. That's it. So you believe God has got no statue? Yeah. Good. Do you believe that Prophet Muhammad is the last and final messenger? Uh, I've not answered gone till that extent. I bear witness. I bear witness. That. That. There is no God. There is no God. But Allah. But Allah. And I bear witness. And I bear witness. That Prophet Muhammad. That Prophet Muhammad. Is. Is. The messenger. The messenger. And servant of Allah. And messenger and servant of Allah. MashaAllah sister. Thank you. Now you're a Muslim. <laughs> the choice is entirely <laughs> yours. <laughs> You cannot prove robbing is bad. You cannot prove raping is bad. <laughs> and we'll see to it that he takes my daughter to Jannah. The biggest mistake humanity made was, they started saying marriages are made in heaven. That's why it's such a mess. <laughs> Um, the funny thing is the fact that the attitude of this was very, very funny. I mean, it doesn't make sense. The sad group part, I love sad group. The sad group part didn't make any sense to me. Because Dr. Zaki Naik is talking about something and you, they used a certain clip from I don't even know what sad group was talking about to compare the, the thing. Said the entire video doesn't make sense. Otherwise, I don't understand why people like to compare the two or want them to like butter it out because they, I feel like they talk about two different things. One is talking about religious things and one is talking about, I feel like Sadhguru is just one of those that talks about, maybe he talks about, it's like he's just giving you life, le life lessons, not based on any Bible, not based on any, I mean, not based on any religion. So, I don't know what to make of this video. If they wanted to achieve comedy, that they did through the editing. Otherwise, the content of this, when it comes to making sense, is a little bit confusing. But then again, I don't understand what, what the whole point of this is. Otherwise, let me know what you guys think. Your thoughts are what counts. A big shout out to the person that suggested this. Thank you very much. And make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in my next reaction video.